been called the reverse Trayvon Martin case. A Hispanic man dead, shot and killed in the parking lot of a South Phoenix Taco Bell, and the shooter in this case is black. He told police he only shot in self-defense, but still a grand jury indicted him on second-degree murder charges. Fox 10's Mia Garcia live with an update on the case. Mia. Hi, Carrie. His trial will start next month on August 14th. The shooter again is facing a second-degree murder charge. He's not in jail right now. Jude Cordell on supervised release as he waits for trial. He's accused of killing 29-year-old Daniel Atkins at this Taco Bell. Jude says it was self-defense. Atkins' family believes he was murdered. He needs to be behind bars. I will never see my brother again. Atkins was developmentally disabled. Last year, he was walking his yellow lab lady down the street. Jude was pulling out of the Taco Bell drive through and almost ran over Atkins and his dog. Atkins allegedly hit the car and yelled at Jude, and that's when Jude says he feared for his life, pulled out a gun, and shot Atkins. Police didn't arrest Jude right after the shooting, but four months later, a grand jury indicted him. If he felt that my brother was threatening him, he could have easily just rolled up the window, call the cops. One of the conditions of Jude's release was once a month drug testing. According to court records, Jude failed a drug test in May, but he wasn't sent back to jail. He was ordered to take weekly drug tests instead. Jude's trial, less than four weeks away. I forgave him for what he did. It's hard for a father to do, but if I hate somebody, I'm just as bad as he is. And Jude is also on an 18-month probation stemming from another arrest for possession of marijuana. I'm Mia Garcia, Fox 10 News.